Hi, this is Katherine Dubberly, the answer lady. I'm working with my Nancy's yarn ball winder. And the question has come up, I and other knitters would like to know, how much yarn will this winder really hold in a single ball? A friend of mine gave me a whole bunch of bargain yarn to help me with my um, charity knitting projects. You all probably know already that I try to knit 100 hats a year for Country Knitting of Maine's Keeping Maine Warm project. That takes a lot of yarn, and my friends are good to me. They try to contribute. So I'm going to try to keep winding this bargain yarn with my Nancy's winder and see how far I can get, how much of it I can get. Each of these skeins is a worsted weight knitting from Windhuck. It looks like vintage yarn and each skein is three and a half ounces. And I'm about to come to the end of my first skein. There is really no sense in showing you absolutely every turn of the winder, but I will keep track of the time so that you have a clue how long does the whole thing take and I have a clue as well. I am now on skein number four. Each skein has taken less than a minute and a half, even though you will notice that I am cranking rather slowly. I have discovered that tempting as it is to go super fast, that increases the likelihood of your giant ball of yarn flying across the room. Not a good thing. So I'm cranking slowly, and yet each skein takes between one and one and a half minutes. Since these are three and a half ounce skeins, if I make it to the end of this one, I should be right at a 15 ounce ball. But I'm not going to quit on you until it really isn't possible to do anymore. That's what we're trying to see. I am part way through the fifth skein now. I have my doubts that I'm going to get the whole fifth skein on, but this is pretty impressive, don't you think? Okay, there we go. That's the point at which we have to stop. I knew it was time to stop because it quit turning and you can see why. I have bumped into the structure. So I'm going to cut the yarn and put it on the yarn scale and see how much we actually got on of this worsted weight yarn. I can see that you could somewhat affect the capacity by how tightly you wound. We're right at a pound. I think that's an impressive performance and I think that's what Nancy's claimed so they were right on target. 